one of my sons was killed in the beginning of the year, and his murder is still unsolved. Um, and I would just like to see no mother go through um, what I had to endure. Russia bus is location. Confirm mail shot. Russia bus. Shot fire, shot fire. Radio copy, shot fire. Where is my friend? Where is my friend? Where is my friend? Where is my friend? Zero Youth Violence is Allentown's version of the international cure violence model. The cure violence model has been used across the world to decrease violence up to 70% in the cities that it has actually been established. What zero youth violence does is allow those who are most affected by the pain to get involved in the change. We look at violence as a, as a uh, public health epidemic. You know, violence is a contagious disease. And to, to stop this contagious disease, we need leadership from amongst the people. I've been a member of Allentown for the past 24 years. The reason why you want to get involved, because at the end of the day, you don't want to have your kid at risk. Uh, you want to have your kid grow up and have a successful life. And we want to stop the violence in the city of Allentown. Currently, Zero Youth Violence has a mentorship program in both Allen High School and Central Elementary School. We have basketball clinics that are free for the community. We have the King's Court, which allows men who have been to prison to find a way home. It allows them to be reacclimated with society while giving them reasonable skills that allows them to move on. Uh, we also have the Queen's Court or the Mom Support Group, which supports mothers who've lost their children to violence. We understand that in treating violence for youth, we also have to support their parents. Uh, the big piece of my life is the fact that I had mentors, right? When growing up younger, uh, having some of those traumatic experiences, I didn't know how to channel my energy. Um, I was angry, um, I was explosive. It wasn't until I had mentors to kind of guide me along and kind of help me channel that energy um, into getting better grades and uh, into sports um, and to art um, and really having a place and a space for me to express my feelings um, in a more productive way, right? It takes, it takes a, a village to raise a child. It takes a village to build on, on top of the village that we, read, that we already have. So the more people that we get involved, the more that we can do, the more outreach we can do, the more people that we can touch. With that happening, there'll be less violence in Allentown. Oftentimes we see solutions being brought into our community from outside our community and they essentially don't work. You know, so, so what we've done here is we're partnering with uh, faith-based communities, we're partnering with health systems, we're partnering with criminal justice organizations, we're partnering with neighborhood associations, with neighbors, with grandmothers, with people that really care, live, and uh, have been working through and surviving the issues of violence in our community for some time, man. Um, this is a strength-based model, and it's, it's been a pleasure to, to see people that oftentimes are not recognized for all that they bring and the potential that, that, that exists within them to be raised up to a space of leadership to solve this, this major issue. We can do something about this, and we're gonna continue to try like hell.